Hello and welcome to Capitan Morgan's War Games and today is an unboxing of the Indomitus Space Marines half of the uh, new 9th edition box set. We've already done this if you want to have a check out his Necron unboxing uh, the dis link and description in the box on the, uh, below Yep. It might even appear up here somewhere. Oh, oh, oh yeah, I'm not sure. <laughs> I can never remember which side it pops up. But, happy little children. Christmas has come early. Yes. I think so. <laughs> Doesn't smell like a book. <laughs> well, mine's open. Yeah. We've done a fantastic, fantastic look at the Necrons. Uh, I, I, I've been impressed with what I saw the sculpts on the Necrons. Uh, and well, we didn't look at the the primary stuff we just right. looked at the, the uh, Necron stuff and the sc sculpting and the, and the design on that was impressive I very mean, impressive I, uh, for a price as well mm. uh, 61 models war book um, yeah. for me it's well worth the money yeah now if you like A&E or inside the ambulance Nick has been very brave uh, <laughs> and given me a scalpel to open this box set. I will, I will not, will try not to cut an artery <laughs> like this. So, well, so we're looking at the Space Marine half yeah, now, is yeah. it right? Yeah. It's definitely time for it a beer. It might be Blood Angels. <laughs> it's definitely time for a beer. I was so excited when I opened mine. I was nervous because I was <laughs> doing the scale book. <laughs> My wife doesn't even let me hold Sharpies. <laughs> Wait, quick. <laughs> you see, I'm, you can tell I've got lots of kids because at Christmas I'm the one holding the camera and the back of the <laughs> liner. <laughs> Right, on the other side. We were saying yeah, that the, uh, look, the quality yeah. of this box is yeah, awesome, isn't it? Pictures all the way around. I, I like the box. I think even once you're done with it, it's a good storage oh, box yeah, to yeah. have. And it would be better if it had a giant Necron on the front as opposed to a giant Space Marine, though. Yeah, uh, and I, 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 these are going up on my board. I, 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 I like. Like those, there. they're pretty cool. Yeah, posters. You would have. It would have been nice if you could have had a. And that one would have been yeah. very nice, wouldn't it? Right? Yes, it would. Have, it would have been. Oh, well. I I've mean, got, I've, I've got, got two, two Space Marine ones. In but there. you've got your postcard. You can pull up there. Yeah, I've got my postcard. And that's Necrons. Yay! <laughs> no, I'm not looking at them. <laughs> no, right. It's always nice to have another look. Yeah, you. So just to explain to your viewers, so basically we've got two boxes. Boxes, we went halves, didn't we? Halves each, so we've got a rule book each. Yeah. I'm having two Necron uh, sets and you're having two Marine sets. Yeah. These will be for your Space Wolves, yeah? The, these are going to be for Space Wolves, yes. So I'm not doing any other chapter. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, though if I was, t uh, uh, I think you're probably looking at Iron, uh, iron Fist's look pretty good, but I think for practicality uh, I've got a Space Force Army I, I'm looking at the bikes and the blade guard especially yeah. too. Why did you choose Space Force then out of all the factions? I don't like particularly like Space Marines and they were probably the most yeah. unlike yeah. Space Marines. Well, well, I've actually got a Space Marine and uh, Space Wolves Army yeah, yeah, as well. I've, I've seen yours. I, like I went. I went for Thirteenth Company, and for the very same reason, I wasn't a huge Space Marine fan. But those Fenrisian Wolves in the army, very Xenos-ish yeah, type I, I, of feel. I, I, I do love the Wolves, and I, I mean, the thing about Wolves are they're, they're very loyal. They make mate for life, and. That sort of feel, and the space walls again. They're, they're a pack. They're loyal, yeah. to, and and they're, they're quite quite vicious. Especially they like to get up close and personal. So yeah. that's another reason. I, I'm quite uh, even both really in this day and age. But 
it's uh, the close combat's not it's more, more about the range I love us now with new books. <laughs> Must be in here, man. So this is the Edge of Silence book, book which is the instruction book for building book there. and the data card. Yeah, this, this is, uh, it's got a bit of uh, law about the Primaris and uh, the Necrons, the Ancients Arisen. Pariah Crusade, uh, Silent Kingdom. Uh, no points in there. There's no points in this. But so we've got the chapter approved as well, so we can look up the points, yeah. which presumably, like the Necrons one, the Indomitus set will be in here. Yep, at the back. Yep. So we've got the points there, ready to go. So. So who's first? Primaris Captain. Captain. Oh, well, what fun looking at Space Marine, see? Eh? Yeah. I'm assuming it's that one. Let's have a look. Primaris Captain is 105 points. Yep, so he's 105 points. That's the uh, model, if you haven't seen it. And look, I. Again, look at that detail. They've, they, they've outdone themselves on the details. Uh, Considering they're all push fit, the, yeah. the detail's amazing, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, you. And not the blue coloured plastic either. No. It's like proper plastic. Yeah, I, I, I've, I've been impressed with the amount of detail they've gone into on on the Necron side as well as this. Uh, right, let's see. Well, pretty much standard. Captain, he's bolt pistol, master craft, it's all frag crack and they he's got a relic shield. So on the any any mortal wounds on the four plus is ignored and it, it's a plus one to to his save and he gets a four plus in ball from the iron halo. Not too and, much then no. No and a reroll aura of hits of one for friendly chapter within six so uh, pretty standard captain yeah. but the relic shield that's nice mm. being able to shrug mortal wounds yeah. on the four and it's a four plus not a five or a six no and it's a 50 percent chance yeah that in some ways maybe the new addition like always like probably now we've got more of a counter to mortal wounds because when Mortal Wounds came out, yeah. it was like, oh my, that was it. It was like the ultimate thing. Yeah. Now, then gradually we're getting stuff that, oh, actually, you can save a Mortal Wound. It's a little bit like uh, Invulnerable Saves used to be, isn't it? Yeah. You know, it, almost like a power creep, I suppose. Yeah, I mean, uh, again, points-wise, yeah, he, he's probably very uh, useful to put him in. I'll, I'll, power Swords, all right. Uh, He'll have the he'd get the space force uh, ability rather than angels of death, but I like the space force one. Though that's the uh, any time of their uh, charge, you'll get a heroic intervention. They add two to the attacks instead of one, which puts him at seven attacks. Right, that's pretty. Handy. Is that actually right. the right spray? Isn't isn't that the one with the skeleton on the shield? If that has got the. Uh, or is it the other one? I think it's the other yeah. one. It's because he's got, uh, yeah, he's got the, it's that one with the... Yeah, yeah. But he's still, uh, uh, you can see... He is one of the coolest ones in the yeah. set, uh, the, the Space Marine set. You put the, yeah, you've got to build the skeleton yeah. on, onto the... You know what I like him, it's like, he's almost like a Necron. It's basically a Necron. Yeah, you are, uh, I could, I could <laughs> actually... It is a Necron. I could actually put it in as a Necron, couldn't I? I think he might be on the base. No, that's on the base. Is that? No, it's not. No, it's it. The shield has. Or is that that's the. Yeah, no, it's just definitely just a skeleton yeah, on the shield. Yeah, because he's. Yeah, it should be. So that must be on the base. Um, the Necron on the base. Oh. He's standing on the Necron. That's. There's a good. That's a plus, I isn't it? Leave it. it. Got to be a plus that's for him. That's not fair. A couple different heads, helmeted and 
yeah, it's not bad, and a nice little scenic base for it. That obviously goes on top of the other base. Yeah. So, save me having to build, build a scenic for him. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not too unhappy for uh, reasonable points. And so we've got um, a, a long overdue needed pro Maris lieutenant next. Yes, uh, again. Because there's just not enough of them. I mean, he looks slightly lower in points because his power level of four. So let's have a look. A Primaris Lieutenant is 90 points. Not bad. Yeah. Yes, sir. And again, uh, as usual, he gets. Look at this, like weapon skill, ballistic skill two. Just been looking at the Necrons, similar <laughs> points. Yeah. The threes. But, I mean, decent weapon. Okay, no AP on it, but the fact that if you're rolling sixes, you're inflicting more wounds on top of other and it's a 15 inch pistol mm -hmm. rather than a 12, and it's two two, two shots. Yeah. Damage too as well. Yeah. Like a and you're re-rolling wounds of one for him. Mm. So you improving the chances of sixes. So I mean different Storm Shield's changed in this. Whether mm. they're going to change the Storm Shield across, uh, and I've seen a lot of people say, that, say this because, uh, and so at the moment, Storm Shield could be broken because you could get, like my uh, Space Wolves uh, Terminators, yeah. 2 plus save, it gives it a save of 1. If, you're only failing on a modifier mm -hmm. rolls of one. one. Mm. So whether that will change, mm. I'm sure there will be an in, 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 very, in the very room, very yeah. soon, right? But there. I mean, it's not bad. It gives him a two plus save and, and a four plus in roll. That's not too bad. It's, he's got a very well wound up or so him and the captain together. Uh, that's pretty handy. So you've got very traditional characters, haven't you? You've got a captain, yeah. a lieutenant and a chaplain. Yeah, but so they, I think they change the names when they come to Space Wars. I'd mm. have to look at uh, yeah. what they get. But yeah, it'd be like a Wolf Lord. Yeah, and Wolf Lord. And, yeah. Wolf uh, Rune Priest. Yeah, yeah Wolf, Wolf Priest. Wolf Lord, Wolf, yeah. Okay, so Primaris Chap Chaplain is... 85 points. And he should be on one of these. Dudes. They all look the same, don't they, Rich? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah these you these boring did. space marines. I mean, these lovely space marines. Well, that's the intercessors, and that's the intercessors, and that's the bike. You might find these on an actual big sprue, because some of the Necrons were, weren't they? Oh, Here that's it. Yeah, yeah he's, on, he's on with a Judici. Yeah. yeah. He's been there. So that's got, and the Blade Guard, Guard Veterans, that's him, there, with the yeah. fourth stave sort of thing. He looks very cool. Yeah, he so he'd be cool. a wolf, wolf, wolf Priest, I believe, it, it would be his version of it. What, how many points is he? Not, uh, I think I said mm, 95, 95, 95, I think. Yeah, so not bad. 85. 85, so yeah. spiritual leaders can use the units can use his leadership, which isn't the bad. No, Litany of hate, that's always history. good. Litanies are always handy. Uh, Rosaria, so he gets a four plus symbol. Reroll hips. Yeah, three plus save. All right, so it's, again, there's not much, you, a, a decent solid. Uh, HQ again, uh, just up to Prime Hours. But I, I, it is the next guy I'm looking at. He, he, he's the one that I, I'm really looking in. in, in Judica. In, yeah. Judia, Judica. Ju no, Judicia. Judici. Du Judicia. 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 I like judiciary, I think. He is. He is 85 points as well, all similar sorts of points, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, but this guy, this guy's, uh, he gets 
Four plus against melee weapons. Yeah. Only melee, yeah? Yeah, but the fact is he always gets to fight first mm. before any other eligible oh. units. Oh, yeah. And unless they've got a similar rule, then it's a rule. I saw this on the, the uh, live Twitch when they were mm. up. He was up against the uh, Scorpet Destroyer. Yeah. Oh. And lost. That wouldn't surprise me, but because they, 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 they I, I don't trust the people. Whether really. he lost or not, in my head he, he lost. <laughs> he looks actually quite cool. I like his skin uh, the, tone. Yeah. They, they, they're giving like, him a skeleton head, don't yeah. they? The type. Yeah, it's almost like um, a skull. Right. A half a skull. I was thinking more like half oh, vampire type. He, he, I'll tell you what he reminds me of. He, the red skull the, uh, mm. in the film, he's got that sort of... Yeah. And, and I love, I'm loving the blade. It's got the yeah, it's symbols got in it, but it, I mean, it's not quite a katan because it's not got the pointy, pointy mm. edge. It's just a flat, yeah. flat, no point to it. But it does look awesome. I'm going to have to do do well to paint paint that. Oh. I reckon if you just painted it to, to the silver and the black wash just go straight into those little grooves. Mm. Again, it's six pluses do more wounds. Strength seven, minus three, two damage. You can't sniff at that. The absorber bolt pistol, nice decent range. Yep. For pistol, 18 inches. Well, straight five minus one, two damage. What can't do? There's not much here. I wouldn't be unhappy with. All oh, these guys look weapon skill two. All of them. Yeah. There's, it, the only difference is him and the chaplain. Their 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 shooting is not as good. Oh, I feel so I'm so, so, so sorry, so sorry for, for you. <laughs> but. Uh, he he looks a proper character on that. I'm thinking uh, six attacks again in the space wars army. That that's pretty nasty. I, I think I can make that. Just looking at the time. So how long do you want this video to be? Haven't we? Been, oh, we haven't been putting it in. Yeah, it's on. Yeah, oh, we Se haven't stopped it. Oh no, seventeen minutes full blown at the moment. We'll, we'll do these quite quickly. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Blade Guard Veteran. Next. Blade Guard Veteran Squad. And they're on the same screws. Again, this, the detailing on the shields are, are impressive. I, I they like them. Are 35 points each. That's Three right, a okay. unit. 105 points. Uh, so one of them's a uh, sergeant. Yeah. All three wounds. The sergeant gets an extra attack. They get all get a bolt pistol, power sword, and storm shield. So yeah. they end up with. I a haven't two. really sort of seen much about these marine yeah. ones because I've pretty much so been get, ignoring them. Yeah. So they get a two plus save would be storm shield and a four plus in bolt. Not bad. That's pretty good. Elites. Uh, yeah. yeah. Their their biggest thing is plus is their strength. Five minus three power sword and two damage. It's a flat two damage, not a d3, which is what the older power swords were. Right. They, they've, they've said bang average. Well, I quite like that. And the thing I'm noticing, uh, just going over to the uh, captains and that, is they've all got the skull symbol. And the Supreme Command Tachman, you can say it says Supreme Commander, the symbol on it is the, the HQ. So, right. uh, in that Supreme com Command to me, can it, will that be just any pure any. HQ, not, mm. a, not something like a, pri a Primark, mm. which is be quite interesting to see. And then they're accompanied by a Blade Guard Ancient, which I believe is. This guy with a nice okay. beard. So these are brand new units. Yeah? Yes, the Blade Guard. Of everything well, are, in here is are these brand new are these units that like uh, are just gradually replacing the the mini Marines? 
like like new versions because you've got yeah. Vanguard veterans, haven't you? I mean, yeah. Are these like the Primaris version of those, or I believe so. I mean, the, you've got a you've got a Primaris ancient anyway, but now you've got a Blade Guard, which yeah. uh, he's at eighty five points as well. So a lot of the HQs are very similar. In well, price, he's an elite, they? so. But, was eight elite? but what a single guy? Yes. Hmm. He he adds one to the leadership for the banner. Uh, uh, anything can. S so you can't each time a model in such a unit, excluding the vehicle beast and morphin, is destroyed by an attack by an enemy model. On the four plus, do not remove the destroyed model from the battlefield. It can. After attacking model's unit finished, make its attacks either shoot with one of its ranged weapons as if it were a shooting phase or make one extra attack. So it's, a, it's the same as the Primaris Ancient, so, which is pretty good. It's, once it's killed, it gets to shoot or, or attack it. Right. Uh, extra. Uh, add one to hit rolls. So four, four attacks made by a friendly blade guard. So they're now hitting on twos. Got to add the captain close by, re rolling ones, yeah. and then we re rolling wounds with the, lute the, yeah, the nice. lieutenant. That's yeah, pretty nice. nice. <laughs> and he doesn't have the only downside is he doesn't have a shield, He's, and he doesn't have a close combat weapon, but. I, I suppose you, if you're, if you're being realistic, you're not trying to get him into combat. Mm. You're, you're you're just there trying to buff those units so around. He's holding him. a Necron hand. He's holding some sort of hand, isn't he? It's uh, it's, it, it's, like, it's, a, it's a it's a little bit like a rosary, isn't it? Mm. Like a Necron rosary. <laughs> <laughs> Then we get into something I, I, I really want, wanted to see. Four, four to nine uh, assault intercessors with an assessor sergeant makes it a ten man unit, up to a ten man unit. Okay, so these um, are 19 points each, except the sergeant with the plasma pistol is 24. So he's two points dearer than the... 19 points. But he's got a plasma pistol. Pistol. So he's probably, it's probably the extra couple of points is mm. called pistol, plasma pistol. The chainsaw we know is is now minus one one damage, and it and does an extra attack as well. Plasma pistol, everyone knows about, and it's they can be made into combat squads so they can you can start them off as 10 and before the battle starts you divide them up into two units of fire i like the shooty versions of the intercessors for my wolf just two attacks yeah is that right that's two attacks uh one of that is free so okay. a 10 man unit would be 30 attacks right, okay so that's strength for minus one one damage that's mm. not to be sniffed at no uh, i think that's pretty pretty good and you've got to think in the space force on the charge mm. you're now up to five attacks yeah so five attacks for roughly that's 200 50, point units yeah that's 50, 50 attacks yeah yeah i don't know and they and they're going to hurt because of the minus one and one damage so they're going to get through two through things so not bad Possibly want them in a drop pod or a, a repulse or something, just to just to get them to, to where you want them, mm -hmm. and and then just pile out and assault again next to some orphan, advance and charge. What about next to some Necron warriors with Gauss Reapers? What and, and cleave their heads off? Possible. I don't know. Get within seven inches. <laughs> <laughs> Drop pod of men. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, I think I've got my nine inches on. That's the only downside. But, again, would be, uh, there might be, be ways of manipulating that if I'm lucky. 
So next is the Outrider Squad. squad. Now these are it's basically bikes. Yeah, they're, they're primarist bikes. Yeah, yeah, again, they're taking the over the old assault bikes, aren't yeah. they? Yeah. Uh, these are chunky old things, but they look again. I, I I'm liking the look of these. Yeah, they are forty-five points each. So you can get. Three in the squad, so the sergeant any morning? No, well, I didn't say no. So, so check. 90, 135 points. So, no, just 45 points each. Yeah, yeah. so. Oh, 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 I want loads of these. You can only have three in the unit. I want loads of these. Have you seen that? Oh, yeah, I've seen it all. Yeah. Oh. I've seen it all before. Space right. Marines. Base two, uh, two attacks for, for the normal, three for it. Outrider. They've got devastating charge at two attacks. That's four attacks. Mm. You add in the Space Wars ability where if they're charged or heroically into thing, that's an extra two attacks on the charge. That's Six attacks and four wounds. Yeah. So you're gonna need two Toughness five. damage threes just to get rid of them. Yep. Potentially one damage three is not gonna do it, is it? Or two damage twos. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and you. I've got a twin bolt bolt rifle at thirty inches. The chainsaw again. I. You. You're not an op gunner on them, no. especially in a space war. The ability to go and tra trace down objective markers. They're tough, they're durable. Just don't take them up against scarabs like they did in the uh, Twitch stream. Yeah. Let them get lost to scarabs. Yeah, but you, you, you can lose to anything. I think that's the problem, isn't it? I mean, it, it depends on the dice roll. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, well, uh, everyone's uh, love their sixes. Yeah, and you, 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 you're strong, you're, you're consistent with your dice roll, so that's that's the thing but and it's a 14 inch I like Thunderwolf Cavalry but only 10 inch move mm. so 14 is a big I mean I play also yeah. the team blades and stuff 14 and, inches is quite big and, and it's a it's 20 inches if you uh, decide to turbo boost mm. and so if, as I said if you're looking for uh, mid-board objective to force board control and force your opponent to do do so something about it. Mm. They're, they're decent squads. Yeah, I think I'd, you'd probably want three of these or at least four. So you double up, so you have to send two out one turn and the next turn you send from the next, can't have you up them coming in and out flanking or something. And then your your uh, thing. I mean, I the old ones weren't. I didn't really like the old ones. The bikes the bikes do look very cool. Yeah, they're the quite thing, they're quite chunky. Yeah, the only thing I don't like about them, I feel that front wheel should have some armour on it. Because the first thing I would do if there's I saw shoot, them, it's a shoot, shoot, shoot tire, yeah. and, you can, and I'm sure the tire is not bulletproof. I mean, it doesn't look like it. No, it should it should, it should be normal rubber. Mm. You shoot the wheel out. Yeah. It. But I've seen some pretty cool things done with the uh, bases where they've, they've had it driving up, up over something mm. and that looked pretty cool. Uh, I like the disc wheel discs on them, brake discs on them as well, they look pretty cool. Mm. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I, I think for my for my space, space force and i think in a, a white scars army the, the outrider squad is going to be be a, a fantastic attachment and i've got we've gone through these box sets and i haven't come across a model where i thought well that's bang average or or it's not, no, not they're, they're all very uh, good quality yeah. aren't they well, well made but it's that, those little design details on each model but mm. but that makes it so and it, yes you can say they push it so they're going to be monopose but I'm not un unhappy with no. that 
uh, that I mean we've got one more in here which is the Eradicator squad it's heavy support 24 bolt inch bolt mount rifles uh, and they're 40 points each yeah and if, if they choose the tar target they choose they're going to fire twice at so very they're, nice they're mount, mount to, a weapon yeah. heavy support yeah yeah I mean these alongside my long fangs my long fangs backfield these dropping in midfield may maybe put a drop pod put them in a drop pod mm. two squads come out boom boom I wonder if we'll see a Primaris drop pod. It would be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah, I, can, I mean, all these new tanks that are coming, yeah. I can envisage how that would look. It'd be like quite chunky, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would look pretty cool. cool. I'm liking, uh, again, if you, I suppose you could put them in a uh, repulse and put it, move it straight up to the middle board. Next turn, debunk them and uh, have them there yep. just popping off t monsters and 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 harder to kill units and and the enemy vehicles so now you've seen the space marines and the necrons obviously we are going to play yeah uh, oh, the we'll box set we're gonna have a, a battle or yeah. a few battles with just this particular set yeah, I, feel, uh, didn't I, did I, I, I thought they said there was a uh, like a I haven't seen it, but I thought there was like a w one in here for what a mission. Uh, no, maybe not. No, no, which, which is a shame. Would have been nice to mm. have, one, have one, but uh, having uh, seen both, what, what are your thoughts? Is you think it's quite a nice even match up? Or I think so because uh, you can say w the Space Marines are, are probably strong across the board or, mm. or every single unit. And there doesn't seem to be a, a downside, but you've got to get them on the tabletop. You've got to put, play them with, with the rules and with the terrain rules and everything else. Yeah. So that that's where the changes uh, come, comes in. I I think they're reasonably well balanced, and uh, of course you're on the day. It depends on the dice. Yeah, it's first in many cases. It could be, but <laughs> new missions, I believe, you can. If you get that decent reanimation, that's going going to make going second yeah stronger. Necron's obviously um, pinning our hopes on a good uh, reanimation, yeah. which we're not going to find out till well the codex in oh. October. We might find out a bit before there. Well, that, I, I, would, I would expect. So maybe late mm. September. That will, will they'll, they'll start releasing like the dynasty codes and stuff. Yeah, on the website. Yeah, I think they'll do mm. that. I, I think, if you can get a decent re reanimation wall, uh, it's going to make a big difference. It will do. Mm. If I if I get that spot on, mm. you you you're going to have a a better chance of having survivability. Mm. The new plus plus one to advance and move makes you a qu quicker across the board, which will help mm -hmm. because from missions I've read and seen, you're going to need to be mobile yeah. and you're going to need to be durable. Yeah. So you, you've got so, some sort of durability. But now with that, you you you're going to have movement as well. Yeah, you're no longer the slow pokes. <laughs> no, you, I mean I I remember when I started playing six six with my, uh, with my mate Dave, uh, who does Necrons, and you've seen them on my channel. I, I I could sit back with my elder and just pop pop. Yeah, uh, two two. I I, I was quite happy knowing and it take him two or three turns at least to get get across the board to me yeah exactly so but no longer especially with the uh, ball, ball sides mm. reduced well you're still going to have the same gap in deployment to start with but the overall board size and I also think that 
uh, ghost arcs might be quite big actually, especially I, if they're open top. I, l I love Necron uh, vehicles. Mm. That quantum sh shielding mm. makes them su such a useful yeah. tool. And the fact now that my, my only criticism of them is it's, it only holds 10. Yeah. I think, really, that should be a 20. The fact that you can take 20, or you, you, there, there should be a rule, a bit like the orcs hanging on, what, that, that, they, they could hold, you could get the 20 models there. Mm. And and it lost the open top last time, didn't it? Yeah, yeah, it's a big it killer. Needs that, it needs that open top rule yeah. back, because it, for me, it is really open top. Yeah. You, where, where, where is the canopy yeah. on Yeah, well it was originally open top. Yes. Yeah. They obviously made it to be open top, and then they obviously took it away. Yeah, so. which, is, which is silly. Mm. Uh, uh, it's just a few tweaks here and there. Mm. I think, as I said, your vehicles, ghost arcs, as a transport would be, if they put the open, at least put the open top back to it, mm. to to make it uh, to make it more more viable to take. Yeah, because without that, it's not really. Even though it lasts, it wasn't really worth taking it in in a, I don't think. No. Okay. Well, I think that's it. Yeah, it is. I uh, thank thank you for. Uh, Doing all the leg work on and get that's all right. Uh, we got there in the yeah, end. We got there. Yeah. Thank you, Lee, as well. Yeah. That's our local GW manager. He, he was he was brilliant. Yeah. And He's and even though I was biting my nails for for a lot of it, we got our boxes. We're happy little boys. Yeah, <laughs> <The> new toys. <laughs> and I actually got an extra box set which I'm going to be giving away on my channel when I hit 20,000 subscribers, so hopefully that won't be too far away. So somebody out there is going to have a nice little, yep. if you haven't already yeah. got one. Yeah. It may sort of have the neck ones like, taken out. You said there was an enormous <laughs> set, I was only wanted a neck one. <laughs> I suppose you could, you could say that the primaries are neck ones. They they work well, don't they? <laughs> You'd have to do a bit of sculpting, though. Okay, so I think it's up to you to uh, end the video. Yes, if you've liked, if you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button, subscribe, and also head on over to Mr. Beer's channel. Uh, if you love Necrons and another little bit, see. Here. Necrons. Nice little t-shirt, see? Necrons. Come and, and come to the uh, Edit Beer Unification group on YouTube, Facebook. On, on Facebook, because it's a great community, yep. uh, really supportive of each other, and I, I haven't seen anyone have a crossword with anyone. There's no bitchiness or, or that, and, and you've got some great guys there with technical help. Well, I mean, yeah. Nick, Nick from Old Avery Great Brick came in, he, he's pretty good on the yep. technical advice. Yep. Uh, and you've got some, uh, oh, I love uh, Voldemort, he, he, his voiceovers and narration stuff is brilliant. Yeah, yeah no, we've got some good guys yeah, there, so it. definitely check it out. That's it. Bye! Jess hands. Bye! <laughs> Beam me up! <laughs> I've got to say this right. <laughs> it's a bit of a mouthful. Why do I get? Why can't they make it easy? Thank you for watching. If you've been have enjoyed, please hit the like button, press the subscribe button, and hit the bell button to stay up to date with all my content. Also, feel free to share anything you've enjoyed. Remember, everybody knows the dice are loaded.